Dragon and the International Space Station flying into an orbital sunrise. All hooks confirmed to be open. All hooks now open and nominal. Dragon separation. And we have undocking. Physical separation confirmed. At 5.15 p.m. Central Time, 6.15 p.m. Eastern Time, as the station and Dragon flew 260 miles over Jakarta, Indonesia. And undock burn number two has been completed. And depart zero burn now underway. You can see those Draco thrusters doing their thing. Opening up uh, an increasingly quicker separation rate between Dragon and the station. Depart zero burn complete. Depart burn zero complete. Performance nominal. Visiting vehicle officer here reports good trajectory as uh, Dragon Endurance leaves the International Space Station from which it docked 146 days ago. We're about four minutes away from uh, depart burn number one. That'll be a 22 second firing of the Draco thrusters to increase the acceleration of endurance away from the international outpost. Again, physical separation on docking occurring at 5.15 p.m. Central, 6.15 p.m. Eastern Time, as Dragon and the station flew 260 miles over Jakarta, Indonesia. And again, uh, we will remain in integrated operations with Hawthorne, California and SpaceX Mission Control until the time that Endurance has exited the approach ellipsoid, which is that uh, 2.2 2 by 2 by 4 kilometer invisible boundary, bas basically a racetrack-shaped oval-type boundary that represents uh, the vicinity of the neighborhood of the International Space Station within which integrated operations are conducted. Anne McLean, Nicole Ayers, Takoya Onishi, and Kirill Peskov beginning the journey home that will culminate with their parachute-assisted splashdown off the coast of California Saturday morning. The uh, track of Dragon in the station will carry it a moment from now uh, across Malaysia and then just south of Manila, the capital of the Philippines. Everything has gone by the book. All of the uh, pre-departure preparations uh, went uh, per the timeline. The undocking uh, was deliberately pushed back a few minutes uh, to gain better visibility, communications, and camera views of Dragon as it uh, departed the International Space Station. We still are headed uh, for a splashdown on Saturday morning at 10.33 a.m. Central Time, 8.33 a.m. Pacific Time off the coast of California. This will be the fourth time uh, that SpaceX will have executed a uh, splashdown and recovery off the coast of California, following in the footsteps of FRAM-2, the 32nd uh, commercial resupply mission, a cargo dragon, and then most recently Axiom 4, but this will be the first time that a California splashdown will have been executed as part of the commercial crew program.
We're about 25 seconds away from uh, departure burn number one. This is a 22 second firing uh, with a delta velocity change of uh, six tenths of a meter per second to further increase Endurance's opening rate from the International Space Station. That will be followed seconds later by its exit from the keep-out sphere, the first of these two boundaries uh, within which integrated operations are, are occurring, and depart burn one underway. Depart burn one complete. You are go to DOF suits per procedure 4.012. Reminder, ground will be deactivating the big loop following exit from the approach ellipsoid. Dragon now maneuvering. Okay, 10 copies go to DOF suits. To the ISS crew, Expedition 73 Bravo. It is an absolute privilege to cross paths with you. Good luck in the rest of the mission. Godspeed. Anne, Vapor, Talk, and Kirill, thank you for your wishes. We wish you fair winds and following seas. It's been an honor for all of us around the world to support you as you lived and worked on the International Space Station. We cannot wait to welcome you home to the blue skies of Earth. Endurance Commander Ann McLean exchanging words Crew with... Uh, station on a big loop. Fair winds and following seas. It was a huge honor to work with you all. We're going to miss you, and we can't wait to see you back on Earth. Likewise, Johnny and the rest of the crew have a great mission.